Now, time for Fox Carolina weather. Weather rate certified most accurate local forecast. And that well advertised warm up is right around the corner tomorrow and Friday, both offering up potential to see at least 79 degrees. I do expect a few of us to get toward 80 and nowhere close to it out to the door this afternoon. It's 54 in Asheville, 56 in Hendersonville. We are warming up gradually kind of on the periphery on the edges of the upstate. We've got uh, Newberry at 68, uh, Abbeville at 67, Greenville and Clemson 62, Tacoa there at 61. And really what we're seeing here is, is kind of a neat satellite picture. We've got moisture kind of moving in from different directions. If you watch closely, you can see the clouds moving in from the south and uh, from the west, and that's basically moisture at, at two different levels of the atmosphere. But you can also see that we're seeing a little bit less in the way of that really uh, dreary, low hanging cloud cover that we have seen all day with the fog this morning. It was very dreary, very gloomy, uh, but we're seeing some improvements. But where it's a bit warmer, we're seeing spotty downpours develop across middle Georgia, and we may have to deal with a little bit of that activity as we move into later on tonight. So a shower or two certainly possible clouds will stick around uh, with uh, lows dropping into the upper 50s around 59 in the mountains. A cloudy sky there at 54 degrees with patchy rain. Seven o'clock. You can see a couple of those downpours around Anderson, Elberton, Abbeville potentially, and they're going to be moving northward toward the rest of the upstate by 10 and 11 o'clock tonight. So certainly speaking, I do expect a little bit of shower activity around these parts into this evening. Getting into tomorrow, though, I do think we'll start the day dry and overcast, but there's always a but, and this one's a good one. We're going to see some sunshine, I think, tomorrow afternoon. And as we see that happen, we're going to see temperatures climb and soar into the 70s. Uh, by 3 o'clock, 75 in Greenville, 80 in Greenwood. We'll make a run at 80 for the rest of the upstate by 5 o'clock. And there is little to no rain opportunities for tomorrow. So with that in mind here, as we go into the rest of the evening, things stay dry for the first time in forever. We decided to go for it on your sky meter. We're going to rate your day a perfect 10 tomorrow. Uh, Tori's cheering. I, I confirmed with her just in case I should go a nine, but we decided we needed a 10. Uh, small rain chances stick around for the weekend. There will be plenty of dry time, though. That's some good news, but the temperatures uh, these 80 degree days are not going to last. We're going to see some late day rain on Friday and then Saturday we stay warm a small chance of rain and look what happens on Sunday 59 degrees and 58 on Monday uh, so we are going to see some cooler air return does look like we'll warm up towards 65 degrees by Wednesday of next week with a 30% chance of rain